Unnecessary foul. I don't think Dave Harris would like that too much. The ball in the corner. Davey. Jackson shadows him. Eventually shoots it off to Hannah. Back with Davey now. Runs the arc. Here's Scott. Looks to go to the basket and then kind of faked himself out, really. And the Redbacks come away with it. Here's Wagner. Mastrovich. Oh, that's nice. And he's done that in the NBL as well as the SBL. If you don't carry a hand on him, he'll make you pay. Yeah. Ochiti did not treat his three-point shooting with enough respect there. Takes the Redbacks to 28. Solon, a bit of a march here on the Cougars. They're 23. Here's Ochiti. Mid-range. And a little bit short. Michael Vigor comes up with it. Oh, Scott just picked his pocket. The great. little guy beat the big guy on that occasion. Just blindsided him there, I think, Damien Scott. But great work from the Coban youngster. Real Former. David and Goliath type scenario right there. Joel Wagner checks out of the ball game. Ryan that, Neal, that, interestingly, that appropriate on, at, at, on Easter to bring out the uh, the Bible references. I think it's fair game. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan Neal back into the game. Coburn Cougar Jr. Won an SBL MVP award with the Redbacks in 2004. He'll be looking for a big game Is against our, his old club. Yeah. Our Rahi not quite there. And we'll get back to uh, Neil in a, in a little bit while, just after this sequence here. Here's Longley. Hannah now. Just speaking to Maddox, boys, and um, it's actually the knee, not the ankle, so he said he should be right. Okay, great. Thanks for that update, Lenko. Three from Davey was not on the mark. Mastrovich drives. Oh, they're away here. Should score. Eventually, Hannah gets it back. Easy basket. Great transition bucket there from the Cougars off the, the miss from Adrian. All right, 28-25 in favour of the Redbacks. We're under a minute. Opening stanza, oh, read it beautifully to Davey. Another chance for a basket here for Hannah, and Jackson got the hand in. It's good to see the young Cougars playing with a lot of confidence at the moment. Yeah, absolutely. Got, apart from Davey, it's all their bench players out there at the moment. They're more than holding their own. And they're doing it without big contributions from the big guns. Ochiti has been ice cold from the field and Ty Harrelson I think has only had one bucket. Yeah those two guys have not had a big impact so far that's for sure it's definitely been their shooting from range that's kept them in it at the moment only one from two there, 28-26 Jackson uh, out to Neil oh not quite Hannah comes up with it and a chance for the Cougars to set up here. El Rahi into Davy. Couldn't quite sink it. But he'll go to the line. Coburn are executing very well off the ball at the moment. That's where getting the majority of their looks. Uh, Dave mentioned it in their last time out with the three ball, but now getting beat there on the back door cut and uh, Davies to the line to shoot too. Rand Davey shooting at the end where he's got a big poster of him on the wall. 200 game life member with the Coburn Cougars. Troy Clark should have almost three of those pictures up there. He's played almost 600 games. All right, one or two. We've got a one point ball game. Redbacks leading it 28 27. We're under 20 seconds right now. All right, what are they going to do with it? Vigor puts the shot up. It's not quite. They've got six seconds to do something here, the Cougars. Will Hanna. Oh, what a great way to finish the quarter. Will Hanna with another three. It's been raining threes. Bit of a dagger too for the Redbacks. That's exactly how they started this game by the open three, and they get a good look right there on the buzzer. Absolutely. All right, both teams heading back out on the court. Cougars. 
the slight advantage, 30-28. Uh, take us through some of the stats from that uh, opening stanza there, Matt. Uh, an interesting first quarter. Firstly, uh, leading the game in scoring, uh, Adrian Meisterwitz. He has 14 points on 5 of 7. He's red hot from the floor. Stephen Van Litt, a great first quarter, 10 points. 2 of 2 from deep. The interesting stat, 6 of 8 Coburn from downtown. It's kept them in this ball game early. Redbacks actually leading the rebounding war. They have 12 to the Cougars' nine. But the Redbacks turning the ball over on offense. Seven turnovers to only three for the Cougars. All right, Cougars get first bite of the cherry here. Our Rahi into Longley. Our Rahi. Not quite. Oh, but the Cougars win it back. Ned Longley, great job on the offensive glass, keeping the ball alive, allowing the Cougars another bite. All right, well, the other game going on tonight as we see Longley with the sky hook, not quite. A little rash, too, falling away. And um, it's a tight one. Hawks v Eagles, 21 apiece, early stages in that game. Mastrovic again for throw. Rimmed out. Looked good from here. Again, a, a lack of a, a real hand on D there, and uh, Adrian looked to make him pay, but a little short. Now Rahi hit the... Hardwood, he's straight back up though. It's like Daniel Maddox is checking back in the ball game. Yep. A slight limp. Wagner and Blake Smith back into the ball game also. So some mass changes there for the Redbacks. No surprise with the return of Maddox that uh, Ochitti comes in. Longley takes a seat on the bench for the Cougars. Davey to get us underway. Ochitti. Ochitti, and once again, not quite. Away here, the Redbacks. My oh, Wagstaff fumbled a bit. He won it back, though. Maddox. Neil. Oh, faked that one beautifully. A savvy veteran there. A little head fake. Got him in the air, and he will knock those down more time than not. I'll tell you what, Davey fell for that one. Hook, line, and the sinker. Here's Hannah now. Scott. El Rahi worked himself a into good, a corner and uh, couldn't do much with that. And a good contest on the shot there from the Redbacks forcing that. Underground pass to Mastrovic. Mastrovic. He's fouled. It, interesting stat also from the first quarter, James. 11 points off turnovers for the Cougars. Redbacks with nil. AJ makes no mistake. First opportunity. And two from two right there. Takes the Redbacks to 33. Cougars are 30. Got a substitution here. Grant Davey sits down. Stevie Van Litt injected back into the game with 10 minutes and three seconds left in the half. Cougars definitely have some great depth there at the point guard position. And not afraid to use their bench at all. Uh, early stages of this game. Very comfortable with the uh, depth they've got, that's for sure. Here's Scott. Tries to float it over. No dice. Good move from the youngster. He got past Blake Smith easily off the dribble, but just failing to find the finish. There's Neil into Mastrovic. That was some great play right there by the Redbacks and the chance for the bonus. Really combining well, those two guys. It's great to have Adrian obviously in the lineup for the Redbacks, but that quick first step there is what got him that bucket and the upper body strength to absorb the contact and make the finish. Great play. And Definite early candidate for... MVP of the season. I know we're very early in, but he's been on fire in the early parts of oh, the yeah. season, as was Ben Barron from Lakeside before his unfortunate injury. Absolutely. Prior to this game, 
Mastrovich averaging 32 points a game, just under 13 rebounds, shooting at about 53%. I mean, it's uh, those are great figures. Be interesting to see when Jesse comes back into the lineup how those two play. That's a good look from Harrelson. Again, the Cougars making the pay. It's a wide open three there. Damien Scott, he's impressed me, the youngster. Yeah, absolutely. Big clash under the basket right there, and it is called offensively. Dave Harris not happy. I think he's trying to make the point that uh, Wagner was inside the... Sorry, just outside. Um, the defender, rather, was inside the D, which is the no-charge zone. And Joel's a little surprised by that call, too. Marginal call, but it went the way of the Cougars. And the home side. Us looking at a two-point deficit at the moment. 35-33 in favour of the Redbacks. Just over nine minutes left in this term. Harrelson, the Texan. Good show from Maddox on the pick. Here he goes, Harrelson. And the tip in, oh geez. Struggling from 10 feet and one foot at the moment, oh chitty. He absolutely should have done better than that, you would have thought. That's a great There's Neil. Great look there, he just can't find the basket at the moment. Oh chitty reads the pass. Yeah, reads it well. Scott. He's a real live wire, Scott. Couldn't sink it on that occasion and he's not happy with himself, but uh, he's certainly a handful, isn't he, the young fella? Definitely. He's had a great start to the ball game. Ty Harrelson, what a big plus that is for the Cougars, allowing him to bring the ball up. Defended by a three man, what he can do off the dribble. Wagner. Mastrovich. Cougars ball. Harrelson transitions it quickly. It's to Hannah. Not quite, and there's Damien Scott. I don't know how he got through there and just had no right to get that ball, but he did. There's Hannah now. Harrelson looking to set something up. Maddox puts a bit of body on him. Damien Scott's everywhere at the moment. He really is. Knocking down buckets, he's, he's penetrating, he's getting on the glass, he's doing it all out there. He's 18, year old, he's 18 years old, boys, and um, he hasn't got much meat on him, so let him beef up for a couple more years and let him get a bit more um, smarts about his decision. I think he'd be a good player. Oh, definitely showing signs at the moment. He's on the move. He denied the ball on that occasion. It's with Van Litt now. Gets it now. Scott. And telegraph that pass, AJ cuts it off. Savvy veteran Adrian uh, Mostovic just getting up in the lane there and picking that pass. Neil. Oh, nice. Great transition bucket there, Ryan Neil. Reads the game so well off the ball, just finds himself in the corner there. And uh, Now, as a former teammate of Ryan Neil, we were talking about him in the warm-up. We saw him out on court with his teammates. He had the tracky dacks on as a standard thing for him. What's a... As we see O'City go to the basket and score, what's the, what's the standard warm-up routine? He does it every week, you were telling me. Uh, he's very structured in his pre-game routine, Ryan. He likes to keep the tracky ducks on, and uh, usually during the, the shoot-around, he'll spend some time on his back looking up at the ceiling, contemplating uh, dropping threes, no doubt. And uh, has a very... A couple of other quirks that's probably not... Probably shouldn't be mentioned on air, rather, when he gets back in the dressing room. <laughs> Right, right before the coach is about to give his speech. All right, we're getting the censored version. Probably a good thing. Here's Van Litt for three. Again, hurting it from deep. Uh, the Cougars on fire again. Van Litt makes them pay. The seesawing game. Cougars back in charge now. 38-37, six and a half left in the half. 